Sure. So this is probably gonna be a big pull. Fleshcraft here. Oh my god, okay, what? Does he know that it's fortified week? Like chill. Oh my god. Oh my sweet lord, are you kidding me? Revival? That pull was insane. <laughs> Frozen binds. On me? I'll just dispel. I was gonna show diffuse magic, but. Alright, look at that. Wow. We just did a 21. I'm gonna friend all these people. Yo, what's going on, everybody? This is Miss Guild Tame bringing you a plus 21 necrotic wake fist weaving. And pretty much what that means is I am playing Ancient Teachings of the Monastery. I'm Necrolord, so it's really the only option I have. I'm not like all you other Venthyrs that I'm extremely jealous of. So very quickly, I'll go over my talents. Uh, pretty much standard talents. I, you know, GG Rising Mist. This is what I run every single Mythic Plus. And again, I am Necrolord, so I run Emony. Really like her. Um, I'm trying to look to see if there's something, anything else that's viable, but I think Emony is the best, and the haste that you get from gnashing chompers is really, really, really good. Um, especially when there's a lot of mobs, there's a lot of trash, and on fortified weeks, really great. Um, soul mine to have. And then as far as damage goes, I try my best to do as much damage as I can. You can see we do have a Kyrian because of this uh, Necrotic Wake, so Anima Exhaust is going to be my number one. That's what Kyrian gives you. And then Spinning Crane Kick, Rising Sun Kick, and then you have Spear as well. And then here's my healing breakdown. Ancient Teachings is kind of low. Um, I wish it could be a little bit higher. I should Fist Weave a little bit more, but sometimes, you know, damage does get kind of high, so I do hard cast for five six guys saying GG's. GG's, man. Um, and yeah, that is pretty much it for me. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'm more than happy to answer any questions you have. And that's it. Hope everyone has a fantastic rest of your day. Hope you enjoy the video. I'll see you later. Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is Mystical. We're doing... I think this is a 21. I'm pretty sure this is a 21 Necrotic Wake. So... We just did a keystone of 20 Theater of Pain. I didn't record it because I honestly, I had no faith. I had little faith, but we actually timed it. We did the Theater of Pain and we, we timed it. And the guy, the bear, this fellow right here, got a 21 Necrotic Wake out of it. And he said, does anyone want to do it? And I said, let's do it. So I was done that, I was done everything too. I think I'm the, oh no, the Demon Hunter, the DH has a, uh, which we call it um, Chaos Nova for an AoE stun, but yeah, this mage is casually doing 88 KDPS, so that's pretty freaking insane. <laughs> um, I'm gonna try my best. So I saw some comments in my plus 20 plague fall video um, that I don't do enough damage, or I should be doing more damage. I completely agree, like 100%. So I'm, I'm gonna try my best to do more damage. And as always, if you have any questions, let me skip this song. If you have any questions, please let me know. If you have any critiques for me, please let me know. I I I like doing PVE. I, I enjoy this. This is what I enjoy doing. Um, I also nice kick on that. I also like the PvP. So you know, you'll see that probably a little bit more than PVE. But yeah, I I, I just like to improve and be good. That's pretty much it. I just want to be good. And uh, so if you have any questions, any any critiques, again, please let me know. More than happy. Uh, necrotic wake it's fortified week bosses shouldn't be too hard this first one kind of I, I don't like this first boss like if i can get through this part of the dungeon without like being sad inside I, i'm good i'm gonna aoe heal here with fleshcraft uh because i again as i say in every single mythic plus video i i am still necro all right and i'm again as always i'm extremely jealous of all of you vent there mistweavers i really am i watch it i watch the gameplay I can't tell you how sad I am that I can't. It's like I'm like, it's like there's a club and I'm not in it, you know? I feel like I'm just out of the club, you know? Um, I'm going to try to stand between a mob. Hopefully, there's a mob between me and this throw cleave. Nope, it was the demon hunter. <laughs> Sorry. I'm try. I do. I do take Mythic Plus seriously, so you know I'm not laughing because he died. I'm laughing because it's kind of funny how he died. My bad. My bad. We're gonna pull this mob. It looks like it's the Ice Fella. So I don't even know. We get Nikes, I guess. I'm just gonna. Oh, I was gonna Chigi here, but. And, oh, and by the way, I do appreciate people saying comments about like stuff I do wrong. I take criticism very, very well. So it, it, you could, you could literally. Uh, as long as it's constructive, constructive? That's a word, I think. Um, I have no problem with it. I think this is the same song I just skipped as well, so.
We're gonna skip that again. Don't know why it's like on an endless loop, but yeah. Um, probably gonna hold. Touchy death acts weird. A touchy death just has a weird interaction. It's like if they see like if it doesn't have enough, it doesn't kill. It's, it doesn't do full damage. It's weird. Maybe I'm just wrong though. All right. Um, we want haste. Yeah. And I'm probably gonna need a drink soon. So soon as in now. I wouldn't even be upset if we like speared the first boss straight up. I wouldn't even be upset. I, I don't know why, but I hate him. I hate the first boss so much. All right. Someone get the spear. I'll get the spear. All right. Spear's mine. Bonus brew here. Drain fluids. I'll leg sweep. I think we kicked that, which is really good. Meat shield. Anyway, yeah, it also is kind of hard sometimes because I'm commentating as doing the as doing. I'm gonna drop that drain fluid. Cool. I don't think I've had to revival at all this dungeon so far, which is fantastic. Uh, good, good. <laughs> I was actually, I, I saw a stun. And I was like, man, can I shrink at this somehow? I actually, I think the inscrutable quantum device would get me out of that. I'm pretty sure. So. <laughs> I don't want to waste it on that though, you know, as usual, I'm greedy. Spear first boss. I have the spear and I want to press it on the first boss, but I don't know. Everyone does things differently. I've had people use a spear on each boss and then I've had people double spear the third boss and then not spear the last boss. It's just weird how people do things. So I don't know what they want me to do. I'll just let them live their lives. Tell me what to do. Do you want spear? <laughs> or not? No? All right. Pulled, I used that, that, what's it called? A wretch? I kept that away from everybody. Just because... You know, you don't want everyone getting hit by it. You know, when you're the healer with mechanics, it's really nice because you kind of, it's just so much better. Because you're like, oh man, we should probably not take this much damage because it costs a lot of mana to heal. I'm recording, right? All right. There's sometimes where I don't actually record. All right, Wretch is on the mage. Really great job by the mage there. Drop here. Yo, I'm cranking damage. We're just gonna avoid that. It's because I have the curing power. We're just gonna avoid it. I feel like I'm cranking and it feels great. This is as close to being a Benthir Holy Pally or Benthir Mistweaver as I, oh my God, I didn't know he can come up here. Oh my God. Got a parkour. Oh, okay, avoid that. Belch on me. I'm gonna fleshcraft this. I, this is kind of one of the reasons why I really like fleshcraft is because it's like an extra defensive. It's really. I'm just gonna actually just do damage here. Touch of death. Send out the. Uh, I'm gonna cocoon on Morning Star. Really cool name. Morning Star sounds like something from like I don't even know, like a poem or something. Anyway, yeah, I'm just trying to do as much damage as I can while at the same time avoiding all the mechanics that that boss has. It, it doesn't have too many. If you kill the little fellas, the little maggots, you they make the green puddles. So I'm going to put my Mystic Touch and everything because we're playing with a warrior. And I do believe that a Guardian Druid also has a lot, lot of... Oh my god, this guy is doing so much damage. Does he have a name? <laughs> um, yeah, so I honestly, I'm going to be honest. I completely forgot what I was talking about. So we're just going to move on. Yeah. So I, I think I kind of a late interrupt on that. That's my bad. And I still have revival somehow, uh, some way. Still have the revival. Haven't used it. Oh, what I was going to talk about is like, everybody does things differently. So it's really hard to say, you know, 
use spear here because I again groups do things differently. I assume since we used hero on that first boss, they want to use a spear on like the second boss and then maybe double spear the third boss. I don't know. I don't know. It's all a surprise. Isn't that great? The fun part about pugging. You never really know. Um, I don't know if we're gonna get the Kyrian buff first and then go for a big pull. But I'm just gonna drink real quick and then alright, cool. Gimme. Oh, why would I assume less? You know? Big pull. Oh, huge pull. Alright. I can't be slowed either. <laughs> Stunned everything. Decent amount of healing here. Oh my god, we just destroyed those guys. Holy cow. Okay. Uh, I think my guy just got hit by... I think this fellow, the skull right here, does a frontal. I think it's the cleave. And uh, it hurts. Believe it or not, we did just proc cauterize. Hopefully we get a kick on that. Great job. There's the cleave right there. I'm going to throw an enveloping mist here. I Thank you for the suggestion. Um, I saw your comments. Uh, throw an enveloping mist on the tank and then just fist weave to keep extending that enveloping mist. Fantastic. Thank you. Uh, we're probably, we're not probably, we're definitely going to skip this next pull. So, and we're probably going to, I think it's hammer. The uh, one after that, I'm going to just cheat torpedo, cheat torpedo. And then run. Some of the skips are kind of, they're close, like they're tight with invisibility. What Plague Fall, for example, kind of comes to mind. So I tend to just do that. Just practice, really. Practice makes perfect. Actually, perfect practice makes perfect. That's what my wrestling coach used to tell me. If you practice something a hundred times, you do it wrong every time. You're not going to all of a sudden start doing it right. <laughs> Which makes a lot of sense. Um, I think we hammer this and they just get, these guys get absolutely destroyed. So... Nothing too crazy with these these fellas right here. Oh, I I didn't have any faith. I'm gonna be honest. I, I didn't have faith in our team. That's all right. Nice, well done. We're insane. All right, just gonna leg sweep everything here. Focus skull. We missed. Avoid if you get the green circle or if you see the green circle, just avoid it uh, because that it does like AOE damage and on fortified weak. I don't know if it kills, but it, it does a lot, a lot, a lot, lot of damage. So keep that in mind. Animate army, he's just gonna spawn some fellas. Get away from me, get away from me, cocoon. Oh, we're really out here though. Okay. All right. I guess it's the ice guy, so it's really not that big a deal. Yeah, we got we got damage. We got hots here. Love the chain pulling. I actually feel like chain pulling is easier with fist weaving, like because the stopping and slow and going is just so it just all our hots just get expired. All right. I'm getting there. I'm probably going to add these guys after this dungeon, too. This, these guys are good. They're actually good. Okay. And I've touched death, too, for this. Oh, don't hit me. Don't hit me. All right, I got touch death. Boom. I have to look at my health. Uh, we're going to put our Nikes on. Really good for the last boss here. Really, 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 really good. Um, oh, oh, okay. All right. Sure. Sure. So this is probably going to be a big pull. Fleshcraft here. Oh my god. Okay, what? Does he know that it's fortified week? Like, chill. Oh my god. Oh my sweet lord, are you kidding me? Revival? That pull was insane. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna lie, that's probably the first time I've ever survived that pull. That's that's always a really scary pull for me. Um, oh nice, he's getting a res, so I get to just drink. 
spear here. Okay, nice, the mage knows. We spear this boss. Is he getting res? Okay. Okay, I'll spear it. Okay, cool. So I'll spear this boss. Come on, morning. Come on, morning star. I got you. Drop this guy in. I'm just gonna leg sweep everything. I don't know how that leg sweep didn't hit that. Are you kidding me? Yep, just focusing on damage here. Oh. I'm just gonna cocoon the mage. I don't think he has cauterized just yet. So, yeah, he still has the debuff. So I'm just gonna kind of keep him safe. Make sure he doesn't have anything to worry about. Oh, actually, I forgot it yet. Hard cast, enveloping mist, or vivify is much better than using soothing mist. I got you, buddy. I got you. I got you. Okay. Um, I'm gonna drink here before. Oh, this is the really annoying. This is the this spell is really really annoying. So I'm gonna put my hots out. Tiger palm, tiger palm. <laughs> Um, I have bonus brew kind of soonish, but we'll just throw the enveloping mist out now. Essence, enveloping mist, essence font. Uh, stack up for the wave of terror, leg sweep or not leg sweep. Kind of start sp light spread after that for the carnage. And I'm going to throw an enveloping mist on my demon hunter and I will bonus brew everybody. And we should be okay. I think, I hope stacking, standing hots here. Spreading out. It's hard for classes that can't really immune that. Like, I've seen, like, other classes that can immune it and stuff, but the dot hurts, man. The dot really hurts. I think this guy, what, what does this guy give? Shield? This is the shield, right? Oh, no, this is, oh, this is, like, the stats. Hell yeah, okay. I'm gonna drink real quick. I don't think I need full mana for this, but, yeah. We should be all right. Throw the spear. Yeah, I learned the hard way that you really want to make sure the tank has aggro before <laughs> you throw the spear. Because I think I was doing a keystone on like an 18 and I speared the third boss. And uh, I died instantly because the boss, <laughs> I just aggroed the boss because you do so much damage. I'm topping the damage right now. Oh my lord. Oh, don't want to stand in front of him. Actually, do I Chi-Gi? I'll just Chi-Gi here. I should have Chi-Gi for when we go to the next floor. Because I'm I, assuming that this druid does the same pulls that he's been doing. I We're probably going to do a pretty big pull. Pretty sizable pull. I like where this is being tanked too. I don't think I can get another one. Nah, I can't get another enveloping. Probably could have done a little bit better with that, but my bad. Wrap these guys in. Wall. Um, that's just revival here. Yeah, necrotic breath. Just want to make sure everybody isn't slowed. Okay. I think we're good. So far, we gotta avoid this stuff. Can we aggro people from down there? Hope not. I got you. I really, didn't, I, I didn't press life cocoon. And I'm also a little, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say he didn't parry, but I guess he didn't have it, so. All right, great job, great job. I don't know how many spears we have. All right, I'm gonna drink before we go up. Warrior gets a uh, orb. I'm gonna, you know what? He doesn't have a lot of mobility. I'll help him out. You know what? I'll, he gets the closest angel. Warrior gets the orb though, because he's Kyrian. <laughs> Lucky him. All right, just let me, you know, a few, few sips. I'm just gonna get a few ticks of this mana. I do have pretty much all my cooldowns though. Uh, almost all of them. Can I, can I stun this? Seems pretty good. All right. Um, I don't have 
I've, I don't have actually no revival. I lied. I really don't have much of anything. Avoid this. Nice stun on it. Nice kick on that feet on the heel. Nice parry from the warrior. Really good. Really, really good because it is physical damage. Um, I would really like to not have to use Chigi this pull, but I think I might. Um, I'll, we'll, we'll gauge. We'll gauge it. We'll, we'll see how we feel. The throw cleaver is a little sketchy. I'm gonna rop it. Can I incap that next one? All right. Oh no. I'm gonna cocoon this. All right. Use on boss. Oh, my! I actually didn't know you could do that. Straight up. That's my bad. I'm going to cheat you here because I have no mana. And I can't get slowed now. Yeah, that, that was uh, that was my bad. I can stun this. Right, let's do this. All right. Yeah, I, I actually had no idea. I've done this place like three or four times now. I've never, ever known that you could do that. So, Mystic Touch and everything. And I guess the good thing about this pull is I have Revival. Bonus Brew here as well. Diffuse magic this. Yeah, yeah, diffuse magic here. And then I can actually fleshcraft AoE heal as well. Yeah, this this should be enough healing to get through this. Okay. Touched at this. Okay, dispel. Put a hot up. I'm gonna drink. 21% mana, hopefully get to like 40, would be kind of nice, but I don't want to miss out on damage from Mystic Touch, so I'm just going to send the Spinning Crane Kick and Renewing Mist. Drain Fluids, incap it, nice, nice, good good stun there by the by the Warrior. Okay, uh, I'm trying to see what kind of things we have left. Um, we have a Spear, we have a Hammer. We have a hammer. Oh, and a spear. Oh my god, okay. Are we, I wonder if we're going to double spear this. Okay. Dispel, I'm going to drink. Um, I have manatee for this pool as well. I also have life cocoon. I have things so barks in from the druid I'm not gonna fret too hard. We're still gonna drink a little bit. We're gonna manatee now throw an essence fawn here Spinning crane kick everything stun the drain fluids and we're just gonna go in here and we're gonna We're gonna do some damn we're gonna do some damn as much as much as we can throw cleaver on me Get out of that. I guess technically I could have robbed that as well Nice DB there from the from the mage Rop this, rop everything, interrupt everything. We're good. Fleshcraft here. I don't know if it went off. I think he interrupted it. Throw cleaver, I incap it. Oh no, this throw cleaver's on me. This this one, okay, nice DB. I was gonna say, man, that, oof, that one was gonna hit, you know what I mean? <laughs> throw cleaver on me, oh no. Oh, nice stun. <laughs> oh, let's just kill it. Oh, 34K, all right, let me drink. These next mobs aren't too bad. What you want to do is they're both going to do a throw cleaver. And what you want to do is you want to... You want to, like, put them on each other. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have no mobility. Oh, my God. My bad. That was my fuck up. 
Oh my god, I'm so sad. They were both pointing in my direction. And I thought they were both... We're not gonna talk about it. You know what? It's gonna call it a... Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna say, you know what, my bad. Call it a day. Anyway, you have to throw cleavers hit each of the mobs, and then it does a ton. It's just like, I don't know, 18% like damage or something like that. And more fixation. This is the only reason I'm not stacked right now. It's just in case I need to get to this guy right here. Nice. All right, see, I can do it. You know, it just takes, just takes a little bit. A little slow on the uptake. That's all right. Touch it at that. All right, we're going to drink. We have cooldowns. Um, I don't know if we're... I think they were just talking about if we're going to single spear or double spear this next boss. I don't actually know. I think we have enough damage to single spear it, and then we just single spear the last boss as well. Because I've done the last boss without a spear, and it sucks. I'm going to be honest, it really, really sucks. I'm going to throw an enveloping mist out here. Essence font as well with manatee up. Uh, throw an uh, And then we'll do damage here. If I can get there. No? Okay. They're still tucked away in the corner. And the storming keeps knocking me back. Alright. We good to do some damage now? Finally? <laughs> we good? Uh, bark skin for my druid. I'm gonna flesh craft here for some AoE healing. I also have life cocoon. I'm just gonna press it. Yeah, that went right through life cocoon. I, th I think that was a I think that was good. I'll dispel my tank here too because he's taking some heat right now. Good kiting. Really good kiting. Stacks are down. Perfect. Okay. Dispel myself. I'll start drinking. All right. And... I think this is the easier of the two pulls of this of these last pulls, but like sweep here. I got you, I got you, morning. I got you. <gasps> Essence font here. Manatee. Dodge the spew. Dodge. I you know. Someone gets someone gets targeted by the spew and they just need to get away. So I guess I could just revival here. Yeah. I got you. I got you all. We're good. All right, let me just drink real quick. Single spear or a double here? Because everyone does this different, so I don't know what they're doing. Kin two, up to you. All right, I don't, there wasn't a definite answer, so I have no idea what the plan is, but we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> All right, I have the hook. Make sure you stand in front of the boss with it. Boom, gets pulled down. And uh, we crank. It's looking like we're one spearing this one, which is fine. I think that's that's fine. Uh, was, that way we'll have hero and one spear for the last boss. And the boss should go down pretty freaking quick. I'm not gonna lie. Meat hook. Oh, this is really, really good timing. I should. We should be able to bring him back down. It, perfect. Perfectly planned by me. Holy cow. Nah, hopefully we can get this kill here before you have to, before she goes back. Is she? He? Actually, not entirely sure. Surgeon. Yeah, I don't know. Before they <laughs> go back up. All right. Perfect. All right. And now we have a spear and hero for the last boss. 
Just let me drink, all right? I just, just give me, this last boss, I actually hate this last boss. I hate this last boss, but that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll be all right. We have a ton of damage. So just let me get a little mana. Just let me get a little mana. Okay, that's fine. 5% mana is fine. All right, that's fine. 50% mana. We should be, I don't know, we'll see. You know, frozen binds, no one's in range. Perfect. Bone dust brew, let's just do some damn. Let's get through the shield. Comet Storm's coming in hot. After this, I'll just, uh, I'll go back to doing damage. That's pretty much it. Ooh, nice hunt there. Oh, there goes the mage. Rest in peace. Can you, can you like avoid that somehow? Wait, did he just throw the binds at the mage? That's pretty lucky. Comet Storm coming in hot. I just don't want to stack right now with the melee. That's pretty much it. Um, they're probably, they probably get really annoyed, you know? So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna Chigi here for, because these next Frozen Binds, I'm gonna just cut out here for Frozen Binds. I'm kind of hoping it's on me because if you Chigi, you immune, you have, you're immune to the Binds. So it doesn't even get casted on you, which is great. Comet Storm. So we're just gonna spread out here, light spread. Okay, so if I want Sink's Bark Skin, yeah. It's a lot committed there. That's all right, though. That's all right. I, I can see we're a little scared. Manatee here. You know, I, I get it. I get it. If, uh, I just say, also, if you diffuse magic yourself, you also uh, don't spread the binds, which is also really, really good. Comet Storm here. Avoiding. All right. And now we're going to go in for some damage because that's that's what we do. That's what we know how to do. We're doing mist here on the tank. Frozen binds. Don't want to stack up. The mage is out of range of everything. Oh, no. Revival. All right. Revival DH there. You know what I saw in the MDI is if somebody went down and they had B-Reses and they had the time, they would literally just have them die and then B-Res them when they come back up, which is actually a pretty good idea. All right. Doing damage. Doing damage. Frozen Binds on me. I'll just dispel. I was going to show Diffuse Magic, but... All right, look at that. Wow. We just did a 21. Oh, my Lord. A 21 Necrotic Wake with a lot of time to spare. I'm going to friend all these people. 